Final diagnosis on Alvarez? Yeah, so he's a torn ligament. Uh, he will require uh, surgery. Uh, so this is something that hopefully we get it done at uh, the beginning of next week. Uh, we don't know, you know, the timetable uh, for his recovery, but we're pretty confident that we'll get him back this year. So. Is that the UCL? Uh, yeah, it's a ligament, yeah. So. Just on Alvarez, you said you're hopeful he can play again this year. Is, is, is that a hope or is that an expectation? We're pretty confident that he'll, we'll, we'll get him back. We just got to wait till he goes through the surgery and, and see what happens. How did Alvarez take the news? Uh, hard, you know, uh, disappointed, obviously, but this is something that uh, he'll get through it. We're, we will help him, uh, and we're pretty confident that uh, we're going to get him back. But as, you know, as human, you know, he wants to be out there. He wants to contribute, and right now he's not going to be able to do that. Eighth inning because it was the heart of the order. The top. Yeah, uh, I, I thought the game was there, you know. Uh, for me, you, you know, with their best hitters coming up, uh, I thought the decision, you know, I wasn't going to wait till the ninth because who knows what was going to happen there. So I went with, with our best guys, uh, our best guy against their best guy. Diaz is one of those rare pitchers where no matter how much trouble he's in, you know that he's a couple strikeouts away. When, when he does load the bases there, just what is your thought watching him you know, try and navigate his way out of it? I still like our chances, you know. Uh, you know, he's one of those not only he's one of the better ones, you know, uh, if not the best. But uh, you always uh, trust him that he's going to get out of trouble. You know, he's going to continue to make pitches, and uh, he did that today. You know, obviously he was careful with his, the two best hitters. And then for him to get back and, and get to Oscar and Muncy was huge in that situation. Were you at all considering bringing him back for the ninth, or was it no. always going to be? Uh, if he was pitch efficient in the eighth, right. then there was a conversation. But after he went 20 pitches, I wasn't going to push. I was already pushing it. I thought the game was there in the eighth. Uh, you know, our best guy against their best hitter, and that's what he, he got in the game. But after he went 20 pitches, I wasn't going to push it. So what does it say about Reed Garrett, especially after his first tough outing of the, the year to come back when you guys really needed him today and, and shut it down like he did? Yeah, he says a lot. And I thought even yesterday when he got, got into trouble, uh, he kept making pitches. Um, but for him to go out there today and, and, and have that type of outing where he was just aggressive in the zone. And, and this is something that we've been talking about as a group, you know, that there's going to be times we're going to ask those guys to get out in the middle of a game with traffic, up eight, uh, down one. And in this situation here in the ninth, up two uh, against a pretty good lineup, their job is to get out. And uh, that's what he did today. What did Marte meant to this lineup? Huge, you know. Uh, we all know that when he's healthy, uh, He's a really good player. He's been doing it for a long time, and here he is, you know, having success, having quality at bats, and the biggest thing, not only he's healthy, feeling good, but he's having fun. What do you think of Buda? I, I, I didn't think he had it. You know, obviously, walks, deep counts. He was up to, like, 60 pitches, um, you know, in the second inning. But for him to go back out for the fifth, uh, it was huge, especially where we, where we were bullpen-wise today with few guys down. Um, for him to go, you know, and, and, and go back out for the fifth was important. And then obviously the guys came in, kept us in the game, make pitches, and uh, but overall, Budo battled with, with, without his uh, best pitches today. Just what did you think of Alonso's play? A lo uh, pretty good play, you know. Uh, pretty special play, you know, especially in that situation there, uh, for him to not only knock it down but having the awareness of getting up and uh, and you know diving on first base, you know another, you know, it, it was a huge win for us, uh, uh, top to bottom, defensively, pitching, offensively. I thought we did a lot of job. Is that just sort of indicative of how you guys are playing right now? It seems like every inning is like the Game Seventh of the World Series, no matter what. The guys are sacrificing their bodies and taking good at bats. Yeah, uh, they're feeding off each other. You know, this is something that they're. Playing playing every pitch, every about I, I know it's easy for me to say it, but uh, it's good that we're getting results. That always helps, you know, and, uh, you know, we see it, you know, we see it from our pitching staff, we're seeing offensively, defensively, and then just the energy overall in the dugout is, uh, is something that uh, <laughs> we're doing a pretty good job of.